Hello, welcome back. This uh, music is different here. Because <laughs> last time I saw an ending. Colors are back. I have a whole new brush. Chicory has one too. There are no wielders anymore. Or rather, everyone can wield. So I guess there are a whole lot, maybe. Uh, so yeah, we're in epilogue territory. Order of the day is just look around, talk to people, and... Uh, see what's going on with the world. Pizza wants to be in casual clothes. <laughs> Not that one. Uh, this will do. Okay, there we go. Default clothes. Let's do that. So what is going on here? I have a flag from Chicory to place somewhere for her to live. <laughs> I can put it here in the wheel to tower. Let's not do that. Um, so we saw wielders in reverse. Pizza, chicory, blackberry, cardamom. Was that the next one? I remember a rhinoceros in here somewhere. Yeah, there were a couple of birds. I can't even tell what that is. Wolf, slug. There was a slug in there. Is that a bee? There was a bee in there. <laughs> what even is that? <laughs> I don't feel like these are particularly accurate to what I saw in... No, oh, I remember there being a giraffe. Maybe they are. They probably are. Okay, it's just they're so heavily stylized and, you know, the uh, shifting shape of the corruption went so fast it was hard to tell. Uh... Oh, hey, you moved your stuff out. Where'd you put it? I'm all packed up. Where? I guess you put it in your decor menu. <laughs> but you know before I move out of here. I think we should redecorate this room, don't you? It could be a community workspace. Anyone could come to work on their own things. That'd be pretty neat. Do you have any decor you could use for that? Sure. Uh, I can do that. Oh boy, the decor menu. This always gives me trouble for some reason. Uh, okay, so what's appropriate here? Community space, huh? Let's put a stump table. Sure, why not? It was the first one I saw. <laughs> I wonder what you would say if I put the flag here. I could totally do that. I'm sure there's dialogue for it. It's tempting, but no, let's not play that way. Uh, oh boy, I have a lot of stuff here. How about a clock? I know what time it is. There we go. And books. Sure. And uh, gotta have a table. This one is old. Antiquay. Okay, there's plenty of art supplies over in that other room. We don't really need them here. Uh, how about a... that's a trampoline. <laughs> I thought it was a rug. Then I saw those two things and I was like, oh, what are those? They're legs. It's a bouncy rubber rug that's elevated off the ground. Uh, here's where rugs are. Probably. I thought I already placed this thing. Well, I'm placing it here then. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, you know what? That's good enough. Uh, I need some seating. All right. Let's have... Uh... What are these? Funky chair, wiggle stool, block chair. Let's put a block chair. Sure, facing the wall. Why not? And a blob cushion. All right, the room's decorated. Lots of seating, decent workspace, wall decorations, and plants. Okay. Sure. Um. Wall decorations, lots of seating, plants. Uh, no, I was there, and now I'm not. Uh, garden? But this is like outdoor plants. Uh, this one's in a pot, spotted tree, here we go. Near the window. Um, I haven't left myself a lot of wall space. Can I like, here we go. All right, clock is there now. Uh, let's put up this fan art. Right there. 
Like, how many wall decorations do you want me to get in here? Spooky, spooky vibes? Sure. How about that? Uh, lots of seating. Alright, more seating. Soft dirt pile by the squirrel. Lots of nuts buried in it. And a few other random objects, something, something. Uh, probably needs a light. I have used a lot of my lights. Studio lamp, that's appropriate, kinda. Um, sure, why not? All right, um, more seating. Woodsy chair. All right, how's that? Ah, yeah, this is it. The vibe here is way better now. Thanks, pizza. <laughs> Let me know if you find a place I should move on to. All right. I spent so much time in here feeling frozen and scared. It's going to feel good to finally be somewhere else. If you do find a good spot for my new house, put my flag there from your decor menu. And then come let me know. So do you want, like, a location outside to build a house? Or do you want to find an abandoned house and just move yourself in? New instrumentation here. This looks like a flower, kinda. Much happier place. Alright. A lot's different. Guess who's the first person I'm gonna talk to? That's right. It's you, Pickle. Check it out. Do you see? Do you see? I grew my own brush flower. Yeah, you sure did. You figured it out. I thought about that time you let me draw, and it just kind of came to me. That's right. What if I hadn't done that? Then this would be different. In very tiny form. Pretty neat, right? <laughs> so I heard you're going to teach people how to make brushes. That's cool. Let me know if you need another master teacher. I've been waiting this whole dang game for my chance. <laughs> Pickles aware. <laughs> of course. You have been a huge inspiration, Pizza. I thought you were just some dork who stole the brush. And, I mean, maybe I wasn't 100% wrong. <laughs> actually... No, yeah, actually I was 100% right. <laughs> but that's why you're an inspiration. I aspire to be a brush-stealing dork as well someday. So I guess what I'm saying is, you know, keep an eye open when you sleep. Ha <laughs> JK, JK, JK. Probably. <laughs> Pickle's just kind of the best. Yes, so good luck with everything I guess. Truly, honestly, I look forward to your brush school. I want to learn to be cool like you and Chicory, and make friends, and have a generally good time. Thank you for giving me something to look forward to. I'll see you around. I just feel like I don't believe Pickle when they say they have no friends. <laughs> That's just, with that personality, it doesn't feel plausible. I don't know. <laughs> this is just, this is the personality of someone who has a lot of friends and is fairly confident about it. Fairly. It's like I can finally breathe again, just when I thought we were all done for. A wonderful rainbow sprinkled down on us, and then all the spooky trees blossomed. Your text is still shivering. Very slightly. Was that your doing? I'll never forget it. It must be nice for you too. Picnic's been in crisis your entire time as wielder. <laughs> oh, it sure has. <laughs> but now you can relax and enjoy it, right? I'll try to do the same. I haven't been able to relax in a long time. Mm -hmm. Okay, there's gonna be a lot to see here. How will I know when I'm done? That's a tricky thing. Color map. Oh yeah, no, it's fine. I figured out why things showed up in a weird order in that thing. That's the map button. It was showing me screens where I had colored in the order that I had colored them and how I colored them. And the like one or two here and there that were dark for a really long time were just where I never colored. Like the entrance to the Wielder Temple has no color in it, so that one didn't didn't show up. That was why, probably. Uh, Alright, that's one of mine. Pizza's house. Dad's here? Hey, Pizza. Thought I'd come for a little visit. Some dad and kid time, right? I've been keeping busy with the holy shop. But you've been keeping busy with the wielding, too. <laughs> We're both just old busybodies. Still, you should take it easy sometimes. I probably worked too hard when you were... Yeah, I probably worked too hard when you were little. Sometimes I'm worried I missed your childhood. Don't miss out on life, Pizza. You'll be old and full of regrets before you know it. It's a good thing. If you regret stuff, that means you learned from it. Well, you had a good run, hey? Was it fun to be the wielder? Because it's about time for you to step aside. I'm going to grow my own brush. 
and show you how it's really done. P, do you have any idea how hard it really is? Yeah, I do. It looks very easy. Next question. <laughs> I have to say, I've always dreamed of using the brush too. Maybe dreamed isn't the right word, but wondered? So many of us never had the chance to consider it realistically, but now we can. And we can all work together to make a beautiful picnic. Or just let me handle it. What kind of creature are either of you? Cloven hoofs on both. Big long ears, horns on you, different horns on you. Are they the same kind of creature? But it's so stylized, I just can't really tell. It's exciting to think how much Picnic might change. So many beautiful styles all clashing together. <laughs> it's kind of like that already. It looked like the, the art gallery or the, the wielder tower portraits. Wait, maybe that would be terrible. Yeah, that's why I should just color everything my way. I'm not convinced your way is the best P. Everyone's got their flaws. <laughs> Ginger's flaws, she doesn't see P's way of doing things. How was... No, Nibble Tunnel just goes. Couldn't I have taken Nibble Tunnel when I was having a bad time? And brushless. Or this was the spot that would have been a problem for that, not up there. Got it. Okay. When you took up the brush, all the colors had washed away. But today they feel brighter than ever. Thanks for all your tremendous effort, Pizza. I think you've really made Picnic a new and better place. I wonder if I might learn to grow a brush too. I've grown so many other things. So I must be a natural. But you think the world's ready for Basil the brush wielder? Sure. I suppose I always saw my garden as a way to make my corner of the world a little more beautiful, just the way a wielder would. To think we'll all be able to do that together. It brings a little tear to my eye. I'm glad I'll get to see the beautiful world we all make together. So I have a thought. <laughs> Sorry, I was thinking about something else while I was talking to you. Um, you know, there's hidden sparkles for uh, gifts. Have we ever seen one of those for... Uh, this tree's still kind of spooky. Ah, all the thoughts colliding all at once. Uh, have we ever seen hidden sparkles for brush style? If not, I don't know. I'm uh, I'm wondering if I need to like check on top of places for the style I'm missing. Uh, hmm. Not on either of these. There's lots of ways to be tough. And I'm pretty good at most of them, but I don't think I could have done what you have, Pizza. I guess you showed me a new way to be tough. All right. I've never been great at making friends. I'm actually kind of shy, and I stink at being real with people. I always thought you were kind of the same way, but you communicate with your art. I would have learned to do that too. First, you gotta grow a tree. It's easy. Anybody can do it. I guess deep down, I'm kind of scared, you know? So I'm always trying to put things... Put put up things to look big. Like asking for a house with tough colors. That's a way of using art to communicate something. But that's not all I am, right? I want to learn how to show those other parts of me. Because that's just about the toughest thing you can do. I want to fix your house up a little bit. There's not enough contrast. <laughs> He's admiring my work. I never thought I'd say it, but Pizza, you're a pretty great wielder. Or you would have been anyway, if the concept of being a wielder still existed. It's the end of an era. I'm excited to see where art history takes us next. Do you think even someone like me could wield a brush? Sure. Well, I've always been more of a critic than a creator myself. If you put a brush in my hands, I don't think I'd know what to do. In that light, I have a lot of respect for you. It takes real courage to express yourself. So, thank you. Aw, character growth for Pumpernickel. How nice. Uh, Alright, this place. Oats. Fashion's always been my way to understand myself. I can be anybody just by changing what I wear. So when I think about making a brush, whatever that power is, I probably already had it. But I'm glad other people might have that power now too. I want to see that world we can make together. <laughs> Pizza's the first one who ever grows a brush and Oats is like, ah, I could probably do that. <laughs> Pizza, is that a new brush? That's not a normal thing, right? 
<laughs> Whoa. Wielder stuff never ceases to mystify me. I bet your popularity is going to skyrocket with that. Well, things are a bit back to normal, huh? Folks used to visit luncheon to see the Wielder Tower, but now everyone wants to keep come see the new brush tree. It really is a sight. Thanks for everything, pizza. And if you ever want to update your shirt design, you know where to find me. Alright, and that's here. Got it. Huh? Oh, I was so focused. You surprised me. I just finished the book I've been working on. It took so long. To finally be at the end of my journey, it's such a relief. Yeah. I just realized, now that it's done, I'll need to find an editor. And if I want anyone to ever read it, I'll need a publisher too. So I have to start pitching. I'm not even close to the end, am I? Aww. <laughs> Are you trying to say you want to know what my book is about? Well, I guess I should get in the habit of explaining it. It's, uh... Well, it's about the universe coming to an end. And a bunch of kids who are friends over the internet discover they're destined to play a sort of game to create a new universe together. Okay. But slowly they break free of their respective destinies and take control of the story, literally and metaphorically. It's a uh, very meta. Meta. It's a lot. I should probably find a better way to summarize it. There was a certain uh, reference to a creative wor work in Wander Song. I'm wondering if this is the same one. It has that vibe to it. If you know what I'm talking about, you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> There's a little bug here. You doing okay? Nobody stepped on you, right? No, you're fine. <laughs> These kids are going to grow up in a different world than mine. It would have been nuts to think that any of them might be the wielder someday. But now, I guess they all could be. Hopefully after they learn not to make a big mess everywhere. <laughs> Well, I guess that's art, too. Eh, nothing from Pepper. That's her name, right? I think so. I'm pet some kitties. They still don't do anything. They just kind of stand here and look cute. Whoa. There's some, uh... Some real swimming in those pixels as the, as the screen scales out. <laughs> yeah, nothing up here. Alright. Um, I have a lot of places to go. The one I'm particularly thinking about right now is the, uh, um, the original brush tree in that one wielder trial. That's a place I want to hit up now that things have changed. Look at this nice colorful screen that I took time to actually bother coloring, <laughs> eventually. Well, I'm in Gulp Swamp, apparently. There's one person to talk to here. And I guess talking is what I want to do. And he's just down here, right? Yeah. Nothing to say. Okay. Uh, what about the places where the spooky trees used to be? That's another thing to check on. Still trees, less spooky, all sealed up. Got it. Uh, they were all sealed up after I dealt with the corruption anyway. Um, okay, so if I'm here, Supper Woods. I'd like to visit the sp whoa, spider, at least. It's impossible to go this way, isn't it? Except maybe in the ocean? Uh. Or maybe, no, this is a dead end. I've tried to do this before, but I forget the exact outcome... There's, like, stuff here, but but it's not stuff that goes anywhere, right? This one certainly isn't. Yeah, okay, and then I just wash back. Okay, well, I guess I'm on the side for now. So that's how you get to this tip of Spoon's Island. The back entrance is from specifically there. I don't think there's anything for me to do here. So I'm not going to go... Uh, I'll take a look at this overlook since I'm right in this spot. Okay, no, it's, it's just here. Um, I want to see the original brush tree since I'm thinking about it. 
Or, okay, so let's think about another thing, too. So what was it Chicory was saying about why she wanted to get out of the Wielder Tower? I'm trying to, uh, trying to piece together, like, what would be a good place for her to live. I was thinking, like, you know, set up a nice isolated spot here on Spoon's Island. Is one possibility. I don't think that fits her personality, though. Hmm. Would she want to go to dinners? I don't think that's her either. Maybe she'd like... I feel like she just doesn't want to be reminded of Wielder stuff in general. Just kind of have the option of more or less leaving that behind. What's this mess? I don't know, it's something I drew on the... Why? What? What is all this? I'm gonna clean off my map. I, uh... Smeared all over it at one point for some reason. Uh... Chicory. Where would you most like to live? And where was the... It was the rainforest where the, uh, brush flower tree place was, right? Or like... Here, this is the spot. How do I get there? There's a bench there. Well, I'll think about Chicory Homes while I go for that bench. Hmm. What about Elevensies? Set up next to Cardamom? The prior wielder who would kind of get some of what she went through, who's not Blackberry. Have the two of those ever interacted that I've seen? I, s I, I don't know how they would get along. But Elevensies seems like a nice place. Yeah, I'm thinking that's maybe where I'll set her down. Uh, I'm gonna go here. Lots of people to talk to, yes. Oh hey, here's my sadness. Express melancholy. What's the quick way to the tree? Is it... It's up high, isn't it? Yeah, it's up high, so I'd have to go... Uh... It's hard to tell. This might go? Let's try it. This very much might go. In fact, this definitely goes. This is the route. Okay. Uh, gotta go through a bunch of nonsense to get there, though. Okay, the nonsense wasn't that much. So, has anything uh, changed here? No, not really. It's the same as it ever was. So that other, the original brush, just kind of got absorbed back into the ground, huh? Alright then, these are my flowers, I think. Probably. Chicory still remembers distinctly where she placed hers. I remember less distinctly. I think those were mine. Uh, all right. Um, let's go to Eleven Z's and put down a Chicory flag and see what that does. That's gonna be here. Okay, yeah, like, these houses, well, probably have, you know, these people living in them. <laughs> uh, pickles here. I like how you decorated here. Real outdoorsy. This is where cardamom is, right? Yes. Um. So, yeah, how about this screen? Let's say right here. What's this going to mean? Uh, objects... Chicory flag... Needs a big spot. Is this going to actually place a house? Um, see, like... I don't know. She needs a certain amount of space. I feel like this is just going to make her stand here. Well, let's see what it does. I place the flag. This is where Chicory's house could go. Better go back to the Wielder Tower and let her know. Okay. 
So yeah, new ha new building will be made right there. Reasonable. Sure. Okay. Uh, let's try it. Uh -uh. Oh, and there were people there I probably could have talked to. Um, I'll get to it. Ooh, you picked out where my new place should be. So you think I should live in Elevenses? Yeah. Sounds good to me. Well, being anywhere else sounds good right now. I'm excited to see the spot you picked. I'll head there straight away and set up. Come visit me sometime. All right, right, will do. Let's see it. Do you have things to say? No. How about you? Nope. Pickle's still here. That's nice. Cardamom, I want to talk to you real quick. It's exciting that everything is changing now. If I'd gotten to wield a brush that I made myself, I think things would have been happier for me. You still could! I guess that's true, but... Well, I gave up on wielding when I put down the brush. I don't know if I want to return to it now. When you discovered you could grow your own brush, you were remembering your connection to the first brush, right? Something like that. It's a feeling you could have as a former wielder. It's a feeling I share. I'm sure Chicory and Blackberry did too. But we didn't learn to grow our own brushes. No other wielder ever has. Even though it turns out we probably could. I think the reason is because, in our hearts, we didn't really want to. When I gave up the brush, I gave up that part of myself too. That's what makes you so special. You hadn't given up yet. <laughs> Chicory learned to grow her own brush too. That's true. Both of you are inspiring youngsters. You make an old lion like me feel lazy. But I don't feel sad about giving up that the, the brush, really. I moved on and found new ways to express myself. I think there's lots of ways to be happy. What's exciting is, plenty more people will get to experience what you and I did. And hopefully they'll find their own way to be happy, too. It's... Kind of rare, I'm now noticing, for people to, like, actually refer to what kind of animal they are, or what anybody else is. That old lion line there kind of kind of stood out. Okay, it's a little, uh, round thing. It's a, it's a tent. Zip. It's my yurt! It's definitely not the same as living in a tower, but I think it suits me better. Feels good to finally be somewhere new. Look what she's done with this brush! I can't do that with mine! I just get four colors, plus the rainbow style. Yeah, you know, my stuff comes out looking like that. <laughs> I think this could be a fresh start for me. We're gonna have to put serious thought into how we teach people to grow brushes. In the moment, it seemed to make so much sense. But how do you teach that to someone? Maybe we'll have to lend our brushes around. I'm excited to use my own new brush some more. You like how I did my place up? Yeah, I do! but I haven't done much else since that final battle. Feels strange since you've already got colors everywhere. Almost don't want to mess with it, you know? <laughs> I've got a lot of work to do, especially on myself. I really want to be better, but I think what I need is to accept myself when I'm not. That's, I still don't really know how to do that, but I'm going to try. Well, I'm sure I'll be seeing a lot of you. It's scary to step into a new multi-brush world, but I feel like with you, I can do it. That's corny, isn't it? But I mean it. When this all started, just getting out of bed felt impossible to me. But we've done a lot of impossible things together, so impossible doesn't mean much to me anymore. Thanks for being there when I needed you. Aw. I'm gonna sit on your bed. <laughs> Chickory. Oh, I can't see my process for this one. Right, it's not that kind of painting. This was done not as part of an art class. Uh, okay, um, am I done for the day? Probably. Yeah, so figuring out how to structure the rest of this is kind of weird. I have like one outstanding goal and I have no leads whatsoever on how to make any progress on it. Hold on, 24. Yeah, 5 by 5, 25 total. Um, to get to the brush style menu, I 
pressing buttons here wasn't doing it. Oh right, it's its own menu up here. There we go. I, I never look at this. <laughs> yeah, this one. This mystery. I mean, it looks like it's probably nothing special, although this is the style maker one, isn't it? Well, while I'm thinking about it, and since it's something that would be probably easily forgotten if I didn't think too much about it, let's go see the style maker real quick. And that'll kind of park me near Potluck, which is a place I want to be anyway. Yeah, that's a style maker. Okay, so it doesn't look like every single person in the whole world is going to have something more to say. So it shouldn't be too hard to figure out when I'm done here. How do you like the brush style I made you? It's great. What if your roof has a style hidden on top of it? Well, if it does, I can't detect it that way. Okay. Yeah, I might just not ever find that one because I have no particular way to look for it. All right, well, um, next time I'll check around Potluck and maybe a few other places. Maybe I'll be able to just wrap it up pretty quickly from here. Yeah, because a lot of people just have nothing to say. It's just the, the plot important ones mostly. Yeah, okay. Well, there's at least several more plot important characters to talk to, Blackberry being one. Um, I don't save at benches. <laughs> just when I see a bench, I instinctively think, oh, I gotta sit down here to save. <laughs> I wonder where that instinct came from, Hollow Knight or something? All right, anyway, yeah, so next time probably wrapping up my business because there's not a whole lot left.